Hello, hi, everybody. I am Dr. Shaladari Ayyara, specialist neurosurgeon in Astra Hospital. I am working in Astra Hospital Alkisis and Almanco. So, in the month of June, we have a worldwide uh, brain tumor day is being celebrated. So, we are giving a short awareness video on the brain tumors. So, brain tumors are the tumors that comes in the brain. So, it can be a primary brain tumor or it can be a secondary brain tumor. So, primary brain tumors are the tumors that comes from the brain itself. And the secondary brain tumors are the tumors which comes from the other part of the body and which uh, uh, gets into the brain. Like um, carcinoma of the lung or the breast, which were tumors which comes into the brain, we call it as a secondary brain tumors. So, brain tumors are not a very rare thing nowadays because um, every 10 person in one lakh population is having a chance of uh, risk of getting a brain tumor. So it roughly comes to one person in every 10,000. So either someone of you, known to you, your relatives, your friends may have a tumor. So it's not a big uh, thing nowadays with the modern uh, techniques and the uh, technical advances. The brain tumors are being detected at a early stage. So, the, when we talk about the primary brain tumors, because uh, once you go to secondary brain tumors, it's like a, a secondary. So, that uh, management depends on the uh, problem of the uh, initial uh, malignancy. So, the primary brain tumors are either a benign or a malignant. Benign is something like they do not spread to other areas, it will not grow again. Still, some brain benign tumors can grow again, uh, depends on the how much it was removed. But it will not uh, like um, come again and again, and it don't need much uh, other modality of treatment. So the, most of the brain tumors are benign tumors, so it can be uh, treated very successfully. And there are malignant like um, malignant brain tumors where the brain tumors keeps on coming. So and it involves multi-modality treatment like surgery, radiation, and uh, chemotherapy. So these are the uh, malignant brain tumors. So what causes the brain tumor is like it's a it's a big question. So because it's a de novo, like a, there is a there are a lot of molecular theories involved behind that. But still uh, exposure to radiation, even electromagnetic radiation, still research is going on. Or uh, exposure to some chemicals, smoking, all these are the uh, um, uh, causative factors. Causative even not even the causative factors, you can tell that's a risk factors. So when somebody the things that whether you may think like whether I have a brain tumor. The symptoms, common symptoms, what we encounter with the brain tumors are initially it's a headache. The headache will be uh, will not the, uh, like one time headache, you don't worry about that. It's a regular periodical headache that comes often and it keeps on getting increased and may be associated with the vomiting. This is the typical uh, headache that comes uh, as a symptom in the brain tumor. With the current advance in the uh, Technical technological advances. The brain tumor surgery is one of this. It's being uh, the, now it's one of the safer surgery. So they have a lot of uh, they have a lot of recent equipments like EQSA, neuro navigation, uh, intraoperative neuro monitoring, uh, microscopy, intraoperative microscopy, and neuro navigation, taxi And they, these are the latest technique that uh, with the brain tumor surgery you you may leave a, uh, you may lead a near uh, normal life. Thank you.